Hi, and thank you for joining me today. My name is Bucky Lawley, and I assist with support and training for Transit and Level Clinic, the largest Lyca Geosystems building construction dealer in the U.S. Today, I would like to spend some time discussing point creation and icon build, icon site software. For this tutorial, we are using version 7.6. Often in layout, field engineers are given the bare minimum in terms of job files, increasing the difficulty of stationing or orienting on a site. Leica Icon Build simplifies the process of creating control and other necessary points directly off the CAD file through automated processes of point creation. Novice users of Leica Icon are already aware that we can automatically create points within our layer manager by choosing the layer and show points. This process can't be easier, but it is limited to endpoints and it will create those points for the entire file. When a user has a busy file, these points may overwhelm the user and hide pertinent information that the user needs underneath. Like an icon makes the process of adding a single midpoint, endpoint, radius point, or intersection point easy. If the user desires to add these points to a larger area, icon has the area select command that can accomplish this as well. Let's take a look at our demo job. For this job, we have received a line text-only CAD file from the general contractor on site. We were given no control file. However, the surveyor has provided points on the ground for two of the intersecting grid lines in the drawing, the intersection of H and 260 and the intersection of E and 210. The creation of these points will provide all we need to orient the instrument properly, allowing us to move forward with the layout of the entire project. From the home screen, we will choose our sketching application. If you haven't investigated the sketching application, please join us on our icon sketching video on our YouTube channel. Sketching is super powerful and completely unmatched by any other brand in the market today. On the bottom toolbar, we will see two menu options. The first is our toolbox, which contains substyle menus for whatever function we have chosen in the box next to it. By default, we start in the points and lines function. This function allows us to sketch an entire project, parts of the project, or other necessary information like offsets. For this tutorial though, we will concentrate on the point creation function in this menu. Once we have selected our point creation function, the submenus in the toolbox to the left hand side will change, giving us new tool options for point creation, such as distance distance, distance angle, angle angle, intersection, and a variety of others. For this tutorial, we will focus on snap points. Once snap points is selected, a toolbar will appear to the bottom right hand side of your screen. Let's review what these buttons do. The top button, Code, allows us to add a code or description for all of the points that we look to create while selected. If this is important to you, simply click on the Code button and select the code from the list or description that you want to use. If there are no codes or descriptions in this list, you can select the toolbox and New to create that code. When you are finished, simply click Code Off again to turn it off. In the top right, we have our radius point snap, followed by our midpoint snap, and our intersection snap. We can select one of these or multiple of these to create points automatically. For each menu selected, instructions will appear in the top right hand corner. Follow these instructions and select the green check in the bottom right hand corner to save. In the top left, we have our area select option. We can use this option to select an entire area or a partial area of our drawing. For example, we may want to create midpoints in the central area of this drawing. We'll select our area select option, outline our perimeter, 
and then hit the green check mark to highlight all of the areas we're looking for. As you can see, each of these lines will highlight and your midpoints and intersection points will appear as they are selected in the right hand side menu. To save these points, simply hit the green check mark. To erase these points, simply hit the erase function. All of these points will appear in your drawing regardless of the application that you choose. These points will also be available to you in your point list with information such as code, northern, easting, elevations, and point number. Leica Icon simplifies layout. From the simplest of plans to the most graphic 3D files, choose Leica Geosystems when it has to be right. For more information on our company or to contact us for further assistance, please visit us on the web at www.transitandlevel.com.